G gets messed up in the first place and causes low free testosterone, it's because people are under eating. This has a little bit to do with the cholesterol and fat level, but also when you're under eating, your body will over produce SHBG as a stress response. Secondarily, one of the ways to get it to come down is through lifting weights. Lifting weights has been tested to lower SHBG better than almost anything you could do physically in your day-to-day -day life. Other things that are gonna increase or like negatively affect SHBG are inflammation in the body. And the most inflammation is gonna come from a high glycemic diet, putting too much sugar in, and can be easily avoided. Uh, alcohol and smoking are another one of these inflammation-based problems that are gonna increase SHBG in your body. And, and lastly to pay attention to is your thyroid in your liver. So when your T3 levels are low, you're gonna see higher SHBG function. So the slower and worse your thyroid is, the more SHBG you'll have. And the liver is actually where we produce SHBG. So if your liver is not optimized, if you're having fatty liver disease or any of these high liver enzyme problems, what you're gonna find is you're actually gonna start producing a lot more SHBG as a byproduct of that which is going to ruin anything we do with, free testosterone, with total testosterone because if it doesn't free up, remember, it's worthless. It's not cash in your pocket to use. So some of the things that we can do to optimize SHBG, to get more free testosterone after we've adapted to have higher total testosterone, is we can throw in zinc and boron. I know zinc was already on the one side of the board. Zinc is just all around amazing for testosterone and free testosterone. But boron is a mineral that we can take that has an amazing ability to lower SHBG in the body. By taking zinc and boron, by avoiding too much alcohol and smoking, by making sure our organs are healthy, our inflammation levels are low, and by making sure we lift and eat the right amount, we can optimize SHBG and our total testosterone so we can not only have a mass amount of testosterone in our system, but we can be utilizing as much as possible. And that's going to make you actually feel the benefits of everything you're working for.